Hi everyone, I'm some guy called Aaron, and welcome to the channel. So, I've seen this article from the Leicester Mercury, shout out to Bobby Bridge, because it's pretty good. Some interesting rumours here. I want to go through them, some bad, some good. So, first of all, let's go down to George Ford to France. God, I hope not. I think he's in the best form of his life. But I, I think we could probably sway them to stay. He does have a little bit of a tendency to to leave after his dad's left a, a club. But I think Leicester being his club, I think we can get an extension here. I think we could do it. I think we could really do it. It says here Montpellier is after him. And they're going to offer some big bucks. Oh, God. I hope not. I mean, George, if you're listening, don't do it. Stay at Leicester. We love you. You're doing amazing under Bothwick. Fuck Eddie. Eddie doesn't love you like we love you. Do it for us. Stay, George. Stay. Anyway. Yeah. Pellier throwing out the big bucks at the minute and from what I hear he would be replacing Henry Pollard so that's a lot a lot of capital to be freeing up I think his contract's about a million euros and they're offering him as it says here 250,000 to 300,000 so that's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. I, I wouldn't blame him. That, that is a huge chunk of money. But I hope not. I really don't. God, he's in such good form. But I think he would stay. I, I really do. I think he's, he's sort of happy at Leicester. You watch him play now and he just has this swagger, a smile, and not all the weight's on his shoulders now. Now he's being able to just do whatever he wants. You, you look at that Saints game where, ah, fuck this, I'm going to slot a 40 metre drop goal because, yeah, fuck them. It, it's, it, it, it's, he looks happy. But, money talks, money talks. And the other rumour we have is a Mr. George Cruz. Now, for me, I would have said this is a great signing two years ago when Sarri's first uh, had a tactical reallocation of funds. But seeing there's a few things happening at Leicester right now with George Cruz's nutrition company, 4 or 5, has teamed up with Leicester. So that is a big big thing here he is at the later end of his career he's still a very 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 good player so yeah like i said i think two years ago this was an amazing signing when it was announced we were getting a huge international second row i personally was thinking George Cruz, maybe Ezekwe, Devin Toner was still around. I was like, okay, this is going to be great. Thank fuck we didn't get Ezekwe because he was shit at Northampton. But anyway, so yeah, I, this is a good signing, but at this moment in time, I'm like, do we have space for him? W w would he get in our squad? Is he good enough to get in our squad now? He's a very good player. But I look at Henderson. Shout out to Henderson because he's amazing. You look at Stamen. That Saints game was phenomenal. Callum Green is playing really well. Going about his business. And potential captain, Harry Wells. He is an absolute man mountain at the minute and I think why the fuck is Eddie not picked on for England but ugh, 
No one knows with Eddie. No one knows. But this is a, a an interesting interesting call, and I think it's a good one. Um, uh, uh, he'll definitely be taking a pay cut from when he was at Saracens. <laughs> um, but th- th- this is this is some interesting stuff, and hmm, let's see how this one develops. But I've got to look at the George Ford stuff and say. Fuck off, Montpellier. He's ours. You ain't getting him. But money talks, and it's a short career, and I hope that. Anyway, if you like what I do, please leave a like, a comment, and subscribe to the channel, and share. And thank you for watching, and as always, stay awesome, and come on, you tigers.